Let's join Best Boat host George Labonte as he speaks with Nicholas Haddad of the Return Em Right program, which aims to help educate anglers about the correct tools and techniques used to properly release offshore reef fish, increasing their survival rates and protecting our fisheries. Now, if you've ever done any serious amount of bottom fishing, something that you've absolutely experienced is barrow trauma with fish. And what I'm talking about when I say barrow trauma is catching a fish and bringing the thing up to the surface and it's blown up and when you want to release it, it's not able to swim back to the bottom. This is a problem that absolutely requires our attention and I'm joined today by Nick Haddad from Return Em Right. Return Em Right is an initiative, a program basically designed to educate people and to provide the tools necessary for us to make it a lot easier to bring a fish back to the bottom and give them a chance to equalize. Nick, I thank you so much for taking the time to show us your product. Let's talk a little bit about barrow trauma. What are, what are we talking about exactly? What's going on yeah, mechanically with the fish? Thanks for having me, George. So a lot of these reef fish that, you know, we catch 50, 60 feet all the way up to a few hundred, and the deeper you go is, you know, sometimes the issue's worse. You know, they have swim bladders that help regulate their position in the water column, and when they come up from that area atmosphere of greater pressure at the bottom of the ocean, everything gets expanded. So pressure and volume are related. And once you bring them up to the surface, that swim bladder expands and actually pushes their stomach out of their mouth often. So that organ you see sticking out of the mouth of these reef fish isn't the swim bladder, it's actually their stomach that got everted out of their mouth. Now what we're trying to accomplish is bringing the fish back down through the atmospheres and allowing the thing to recompress basically and go back in there and his bladder is going to close up and he's going to be able to swim away basically unharmed, correct? Yeah, yeah, it's actually pretty amazing. And once you see some of the underwater footage, you'll see some of these fish will be completely blown out, you know, gills expanded, stomach expanded, coming out of the mouth, floating on the surface there. And then once they hit a certain point, as they're descending back in the water column, you'll just see everything go back to normal. Even the eyes will go back into place sometimes. It's these simple descending devices, you know, we've all used a boga grip before. It's as simple as clipping them on, setting the depth you want to release them at and they'll release automatically. So. Okay, let's walk me through this step by step here. You're gonna attach this to a fishing rod and you can set this to open at a specified depth. Yep, yep, so we have this on a three-way swivel here, so you could just tie this onto a rod. You could have it on a rope as well if you sure. want. And you just clip it open here, clip it on the bottom lip, and you can set it to whatever depth. So this is a standard sequelizer, which is a descending device that releases at either 50, 100, or 150 feet of depth. You can see it's set to 50 feet. It's as simple as pushing and turning. That's 100 feet. Then you push and turn again, that's 150 feet, and they'll and release it. automatically. Just toss them over and then reel it back in after. Now we also have one that's not as complicated, just a manual pin kind of device here. Tell me a little bit about this model. This is an inverted hook style, so you simply either pierce through the same hole that the hook made in the fish, and you just lower it down. Uh, so you can actually lower this one down just straight into the water and the buoyancy from the fish will cause it to flip automatically on its own and with a heavy weight like this attached it'll take it straight to the bottom and all you do is reel straight up and the fish slides off like that. Tell me a little bit about the program here. Yeah, so this Return Em Right program, it's a really cool program where we're focused on education and outreach to anglers to do something, do what works best for them to get these fish back to the bottom. The program is focused in the Gulf of Mexico and we're actually not just providing the knowledge to anglers, but actually giving them the tools to release these fish as well. So, you know, the current package that we're giving anglers in the Gulf of Mexico is actually this sequelizer pre-rigged to a three-way swivel and a three-pound weight here. So all you have to do is tie it onto your rod and you're ready to go. And it's as simple as clipping them on and releasing them. And in addition to that, we have a brochure with additional resources. We have stickers and we're also going to give a backup inverted hook device as well. So in case anything happens to your first one, you got two devices or maybe this one works easier for you. Sure. You know, we all have our personal preferences and um, it's as simple as that. We want to give every angler both the knowledge and the tools to, to release these fish the right way. Now, is there some education involved to you? I think you mentioned something about is there some yeah. type of a educational deal that you need to go through to get the free package? Yeah, so what we're doing is we're designing a very brief 15 minute review of best practices, which is actually focuses on situational awareness. We know that there's no such thing as one best release practice that works in every situation. But before you go fishing, you know, we all have a plan. 
we should incorporate releasing fish into that plan. You should be ready with the gear and the tools, de-hooking devices, um, descending devices, venting tools. You should be ready with everything you need before you go out fishing. And this short training that we, we've developed is only about 15 minutes long and it focuses on that situational awareness and being prepared to release fish in whatever situation you're fishing. Once you complete that, you just fill out your information and we ship you the package of gear. So it's as easy as that. And the, and the educational uh, program is on the internet? Yeah, so right now uh, right now we're actually having anglers pre-register, so we're launching this spring um, to private recreational anglers in the Gulf of Mexico, and you can actually go on our website, returnemright.org, and you can pre-register, fill out your name and the sector you fish in, and then we'll just shoot you an email with the link directly. It'll be moved over to our website publicly once we launch, and we'll start distributing gear to folks. You know, our tagline is earn another fight. Every fish that you get back down to the bottom is a fish that you can catch again in the future. It'll enter the spawning stock and it'll produce for the future of the fishery. So that's what it takes, a little bit of help from everyone and hopefully we can have this fishery sustained for generations to come.